Denison barbs are one of the most attractive barbs that you could get for your aquarium. Their mix of color, size, and interesting behaviors makes them an excellent addition to any peaceful community. Native to fast-moving rivers and streams in western India, this fish is highly sought after in the fish-keeping community. They make excellent beginner fish because they are hardy and easy to care. Denison barbs are generally peaceful and they should be kept in schools of a half dozen or more. Let's take a look at some of the most suitable tank mates for Denison barbs. Welcome to Finding Fishes, let's get started. Crebensis cichlids are beautiful, peaceful, and very easy to care for. Their unique color pattern and relatively high activity level make them one of the most spectator-friendly species out there. While many fish in the cichlid family are notorious for being bullies, that's not the case with this fish. They are a peaceful dwarf species that does well in community environments. Originating in Africa and the Nigerian rivers, they can only grow to around 4 or 5 inches in length. They typically live for 5-8 years, but with proper care, your fish can live for longer. Crebensis cichlid care is quite manageable. These fish are relatively undemanding and adapt well to a range of environments. They can be kept alongside other fish in a community tank. However, despite their relative peacefulness, Crebensis cichlids may still display territorial behavior. They are a great tank mates for denison barb. Tiger barb are one of the most loved with among all fish keepers. These fish are fairly easy to care for, beautiful, and very active. They're one of the best fish for owners who want to see plenty of action going on in their tank. Though they have a bit of a reputation as nuisance fin nippers, these fish are not harmful and will do just fine in the right tank. These fish are naturally found throughout Southeast Asia, and they originate in Borneo, Indonesia, and Sumatra. The typical tiger barb lifespan is between 5 and 7 years on average. Tiger barbs are considered to be semi-aggressive and will push around smaller vulnerable fish. They might nip at the fins of slow-moving tank mates as well. They must be kept in a school of at least five individuals, though they prefer no less than eight. When kept in a group too small, they are more likely to harass other tank mates. They should be a great tank mate for denison barb. The neon tetra is a freshwater fish of the tetra fish family. They have vibrant blue bodies with striking red markings from the belly to the tail. Neon tetras are found in the northern and western Amazon basins in Peru, Brazil, and Colombia. Keeping of them healthy is not very difficult. They're surprising hardy and don't require a ton of attention like other fish. They are non-aggressive schooling fish that get along with other peaceful fish of a similar size. Multiple fish will stay close together and swim in the middle of the water column for safety. This makes them fun to watch because they look like a flurry of light when they move around your tank. It's recommended that you keep a group of at least 15 neon tetras together so that they can rely on each other like they do in the wild. They should be a great tank mate for denison barb. The cardinal tetra is a small freshwater fish from the tetra family. They are often mistaken for neon tetras due to their similar appearance. Cardinal tetras reside in throughout South America. They're mostly found in the Orinoco and Negro rivers. They are a docile, social schooling fish that's most active during the day. They are fast swimmers and spend most of their time in the middle and top of the tank. They are happiest and show their best coloring in schools of at least six. They are rarely aggressive and are only territorial during breeding. The typical cardinal tetra lifespan is between four and five years when healthy. The main difference between cardinal tetras and neon tetras is the length of this stripe. For neons, the red color only marks half of the body. The average size is around two inches in length when fully grown. They should be a great tank mate for denison barb. Rainbowfish are small freshwater fish belonging to the Melanotinidae family. There are currently over 50 documented species in the world. Most rainbowfish are found in Australia, Madagascar, Indonesia, and New Guinea. They are popular among fish keepers because of their colorful appearances and ease of care. A rainbowfish's life expectancy varies. Most of them have a lifespan between 5 and 8 years. Rainbow fish are known for being placid, non-aggressive species. Some subspecies of rainbow fish are known for their shoaling behaviors and should be kept in groups of six or more for best results. It's interesting to watch rainbow fish in large groups as the males will display bright shows of color in order to attract attention. Docile and hardy, rainbow fish should be housed in community tanks with equally peaceful species. They occupy the middle and top of the tank, so these fish shouldn't cause problems for bottom-dwelling species. They should be a great tank mate for denison barb. 
Cherry barbs are brightly colored fish and one of the most popular in the barb fish family. Their bright colors and schooling nature are adored by aquarists of all levels. They are hardy fish which makes these fish perfect for experts or beginners. These fish are a tropical species that comes from Sri Lanka. They belong to the Saprinity family. The average cherry barb lifespan is between 5 and 7 years. The maximum size of a cherry barb is about 2 inches in length when fully grown. These fish thrive in peaceful communities that match their peaceful nature. Due to their schooling behavior, they bring so much color and activity to the middle of your tank. Cherry barb care is very simple. This makes them a great species to own for beginners who are looking for a pretty yet low-maintenance freshwater fish. They are fairly active fish that will spend a lot of their time moving in the tank, making them a great tank mate for denison barb. Zebra danios are very popular and enjoyable freshwater fish. They have slim bodies with horizontal black and white zebra-like stripes. These fish are native to bodies of water throughout India and Bangladesh. Quite peaceful by nature, zebra danios are the quintessential community fish. In fact, many aquarists use them as dither fish to promote more social behaviors out of other fish. Fully grown zebra danios reach a maximum length of 2.5 inches. Their typical lifespan is between 2 and 5 years. Zebra danio care is a relatively straightforward process. Thanks to their adaptable nature, these freshwater fish will easily adjust to most environments they're put in. Zebra danios are easygoing and playful. They're quite active and will spend their days darting throughout the tank. Unlike other species, these fish are not exclusive to one part of the tank. While they prefer the middle and top of the water column, they'll venture anywhere. Hence they should be a great tank mate for denison barb. Rosy barbs are loved by many fish keepers around the world. This shoaling species loves to be in large groups. The more you can keep, the more remarkable their group behaviors become. They belong to the Saprinity family. This species is native to southern Asia, where you will find large populations in the tropical waters. Their lifespan is around 5 years when properly cared for. Rosy barbs have a peaceful temperament, so they work well as part of a community. They are active and love to swim around in groups in the middle levels of the tank. Many barbs have gained the reputation of being fin nippers, rosy barbs are no exception. This problem is reduced when they are part of a large shoal because they feel less stressed. Known for their hardiness, this species can adapt to a wide range of conditions without any problems. They should be a great tank mate for denison barb. That's it for today guys, hope you really enjoyed the video, keep supporting us and stay tuned for more such interesting videos. Finding fishes remember the name.